Hey everyone, welcome back to Dear Cyber Sue Advice Talk Show. Today's question is from Craig. Craig wrote my advice column and I'll just read it what he said here. My kids disown me after I divorced their mom. It's been six months and they don't want anything to do with me. They don't like my girlfriend, which is one of the biggest problems. I'm ready to give up because they won't even return my calls. What should I do? Craig, this is a huge question that a lot of people want answers to. It's not just men that have to deal with this, women do as well. What happens a lot of the times is we don't understand how we come across to our kids while we're dealing with our own problems within the divorce. I'm a divorced person. I was a single mom for many years. So I understand sometimes what happens is we can't even, we don't realize how much sort of bad energy we're putting out while we're dealing with the, the end of our relationship. What happens is the kids pick up on this. Sometimes we say things that are negative about our, our ex and this causes the child to become very confused. Also, a lot of times people don't sit back and sort of just let things unfold and let the kids get used to it. It doesn't matter what age the children are when they're dealing with a divorce. They can be like full grown kids and have major problems with it. But what happens with kids if they're young, uh, sort of more around the, the formative years, like the teen years and up, they can get a real attitude about it because they feel that you're not dealing with it well. So what it's doing is it's pushing them away from you. If you're saying anything negative about your ex at all, you need to stop that. The fact that you have a girlfriend already and you've introduced them to the kids after six months is a really big issue with a lot of kids. Your, your children need time to grieve and you need time to grieve. Regardless of the fact that you think your relationship has been over for a long time, there's a lot of things that you did together as a couple. There's a lot of, you know, way that you grew together as a couple. You can't just throw that under the mat as if it never happened. You're still going to deal with some emotional aftermath. So I really strongly suggest to anybody out there, men and women who are splitting from their, their, you know, their partners that not to bring anybody else into the mix too soon. And if you do, don't expect your kids to be okay with that. They're not okay with it. They want you to be with their mom or their dad. They don't want you to be with this new person. And especially so quickly after as if the relationship meant nothing. So Craig, my answer to you would be, don't ever give up on your kids. They're angry, they're hurt right now. Always keep contacting them, even if they don't respond, do not stop. Keep it going, whether it be, you know, a text, whether it be sent, dropping something off at the doorstep for them. Just make sure that you always, always make them feel that they're important because they are not in a great place right now. The divorce affects them. It's a broken, broken family. Their heart is, is sitting there torn in pieces. So if you have to see this woman, I just suggest that you see them separately. Do not discuss them. Do not put pictures of them everywhere so the kids have to see them on social media or anywhere else. Take time to be with your children. Never, ever, ever give up on your kids. And that goes for everybody. Just remember that their heart is broken too. Anyway, thanks Craig for your question. That was a really good one. And it, as I say, men and women both go through this and the kids go through it just as much as you do. And sometimes you don't realize what you're saying out loud. Sometimes you don't realize you're squashing your ex or saying negative things. We all do it. We're all guilty of it. Anyway, thanks for listening to Dear Cyber Sue. Please contact me at dearcybersue at gmail.com. Leave your questions there. And uh, I'll look forward to hearing from you. Please subscribe to my channel. Thanks, everyone. Bye-bye.